So Luke, just between you and me, tell me, why does the world need another chair? Why jump seat? It's simple, space. Let me show you. This is a typical chair and look at how much room it takes up. Yeah, I can imagine where space is at a premium, there's room for not much else. Exactly right. Not much else at all. And that's the genius of the jump seat. It only takes 90 mil of space off the wall. And as you can see, we're left with plenty of room. And it's such a beautiful object. Run me through the design side. The beautiful ply front on the chair really sets it apart. And the upholstered seat and back as well make it look just stunning. The gallery was about intimate stories, and this is a particularly intimate space in the gallery. So we needed something that was very quiet, mm. and it's very, very compact. Remco, I'm really interested to know how this works. Well, it's a jump seat folding chair with no moving parts. There's two pieces of blade steel. But is that not sliding a little bit when you're moving? That no, doesn't slide at all. Not at all. And it's the shape of the trapezoid shape, so those pieces are timbered together, make exactly 90 degrees, so it gives you so a So it's really like an old shape. arch, and I'm working hard to pinch my finger, but I can't. Wow, what's the kilos? 270 kilos. All right, that's, that's about three of me, so let's see. Yeah. You can both sit. Come on then, let's both sit on it. <laughs> Every designer has had a crack at a chair. There are thousands in the world. The genius of this design is the combination of ancient engineering with design elegance. 